okay welcome on board um to this youtube video so in this video we'll be explaining how or demystifying how youtube studio works so for every subscriber if you don't have um youtube studio then you might not really get to understand the flow of how youtube works so you need to make sure you have the youtube studio available on your device so yeah on this um, this is the dashboard so here you see the name of my channel the total subscribers now the channel analytics i'll be explaining how all this works and then in the last 28 days so in the last 28 days on my channel analytics for the under the dashboard section i have 3.2k views in the last 28 days and the watch our time so i'll explain what watch our time means but let's just so this is your latest published content so as if you keep uploading videos the latest will keep appearing hopefully the first three and then the latest comment you can see here so this is something that is very very easy to actually grasp so the next part of this is your content your content your content so this is where you have um, your youtube videos that you have posted and over here is your shorts your shorts so this is where you have your shorts see yeah if you have done the live your live video it's what i play here so i've not done live or you have um, created a playlist so i've not created it you get so uh if you watch um the video on how to add thumbnail to video so this is where you can actually come to probably you want to edit your video you want to share edit play video delete so your youtube studio is just like your manager it's where you are able to manage just like you are run, trying to run a facebook ad you know you don't do it on facebook you do it on the um the, the business suits manager for your facebook ad if i'm not mistaken so if you want to edit your video you can actually tap on edit video edit video so now this is where you can actually change the title of your video you can actually upload a thumbnail by clicking on this um pencil like icon on the top left corner of your phone you can see public if you want to change the um probably i want to change the only people that um can view or private only people you choose can view so this is where you set the possible uh, the visibility so this is how, if i want to add description to the video this is where i can actually add the description to the video so i will later on record a video on how to add a my um qualities description because your description can actually affect the your the your the rankings of your video you, you get so this is where you can actually edit your videos probably add a thumbnail edit your description or your title so let me just um go to this so let's click this is where you can actually through your videos and know how many views you've achieved easily okay so let's now go to analytics where likely we might spend some time so this is also something easy to grasp so in the last 28 days we've gotten 3291 views now how many watch our time have we amassed and how many subscribers so this is the overview so the top content in the last 28 days this is how it is the views i have had in the last 28 days the top um five videos okay the top five videos and then this is the real time in the last 48 hours how many views have we amassed so 332 so this is the views that we've amassed in the last 28 days so you can actually come over here to see your content so which content has been doing the work for you so how many choose to view this is the view in the last 28 days and swiped away so this thing explains to you the whole process so in the last 28 days 68.5 percent of people has actually swiped away from my video now how many views have you had as 194 percent more than the previous 28 days so it helps you to to um actually understand and this is for short it's under the section of shots you get under the section of shots so in the last 28 days the top shots that have been viewed okay and then how do they how do these people get to know it happens to how, how your viewers find your shots so 88.8 percent find it through the shots feed 7.2 percent find it under the youtube session this will help you understand how you can adjust and align yes yeah, so as a new youtuber it's you want to 
actually understand what works and what won't work so youtube search terms how to add a thumbnail and how did they come across the video when they search on youtube so how to download so so and so and the like so so the last 28 days we've had 1.3k views on our shots and how many have been shown in the feed so how many likes have we amassed from the youtube shorts 52 how many subscribers plus four so now let's look at the videos the video let's talk to video so in the, for the video we've actually had uh, 1.9k views in the last 28 days and how many impressions have we made so this is the top 28 videos they have been, have been watched the top five have been watched now how your videos find viewers find your video you see the youtube search terms external can be probably i posted it on my whatsapp on my um facebook handle so other youtube features and browse features probably the person is just scrolling and comes across your video so look at the youtube search term that has worked for me all right so this is just um that's about that and let's see the audience so let's see this helps to just know your audience it helps you to know your audience and where they're actually watching your video from so we have returning viewers people who after watching comes again to watch so we have the three of them unique viewers uh, here that has viewed the video not necessarily subscribers now people who have viewed your video and how many subscribers have you gained all right so uh look at the age range the age range of those that are viewed so it's between the age of 13 to the age of 64 but the highest um coming from the age between the age grade of 25 to 34 so all of this helps you to understand what content that um favors your audience so male and then female and the geographical location so we have people viewing from nigeria united states united kingdom indonesia and india so this is just the analytics helps you to uh, analyze your progress your success see if you are going up or you're coming down and how you can re refurbish so you also see research uh, we do not go through that research so it can help you understand what is um find topics you can explore probably you want to create so you now according to what i've learned you need to model what works probably you see the way they are arranging their own titles and everything you can actually um, explore find audience activity what are they searching for what so you can create something in line because you do not create a desire you have to flow create something that flows in the direction of a desire don't try to create a desire outside their own desire um, don't try to create a, a video that will not really trend on the YouTube space because what determines your views is not necessarily your videos but those the audience that wants to watch it so you need to also create what your audience would want to watch they would not want to skip away they need to watch because many of them might be on YouTube for a particular purpose so you want to always be at the receiving end of their views so you need to actually explore so the first section of comments the section for comments is where you can actually easily add, know who has commented to your videos and what on what video did they comment on that so it is easily for you it's easy, it's easy for you to reply here so but then you have lots of comments you can actually use this comment section to just reply easily okay so i haven't responded published search um subscriber account and everything so that's how you can actually um use this section for comments now let's talk about the end part so for you to earn you have to become a youtube partner so you have to join the youtube partner program to earn money get creator support and more so how can you be a partner so look at the uh, the requirements so you need to uh, uh, um, reach 1000 um 1000 subscribers and then 4000 plus of watch our time in the last 365 days so they calculate it in 365 days no matter when you started your youtube channel they calculate and see if you're able to amass 4000 views 4000 watch hour in 365 days and then 10 million shots views on your shots 10 million views on your shots in the last 90 days so they calculate this one in three months so it's either you actually get 1000 subscribers and 4000 watch hour time or 1000 subscribers and 10 million views at the same time so now how do they calculate views for shots is just the number of views you gain so if in 90 days you can amass 10 million views and then 1000 subscribers you are good to go to um opt um to opt in for the youtube partner program so you so it is not necessarily youtube that pays you it is this that are running ads through youtube that would actually 
so by the time you place them on your videos why viewers, try, why viewers are trying to watch your video they watch the ad so you have a particular percent coming in as a revenue for you so um so how does youtube calculate watch our time now youtube cal does not calculate the watch our time from shots shots is different but from the youtube videos now each 60 minutes of a video is one hour watch our time it's one hour watch is one watch hour time excuse me one watch hour time so let's say for instance you created a 10 minutes video and then six people happens to watch that video then i would say you've just gotten one hour one watch hour time so it's calculated like just one hour 60 minutes means one hour so take for instance you are able to get 100 people to watch um your six your six minute video yeah you can actually say you've arrived at all right so, so the go to so the way to really achieve having much views so this channel as i when i'm um, creating this video is just four months old four months plus old so I've, we have arrived at 120 public public watch hour time so if you multiply it by 60 minutes 120 hours by 60 minutes you know that oh we've really gone far on this so 40 4 000 watch hour time is is 240,000 minutes of video so one way to go the way to go about it is to come be consistently and create videos and upload on youtube and then drive traffic to the video or also you can also create long form content that's okay for you to be able to achieve your watch hour time you are creating your videos probably 10 minutes probably 15 minutes but don't make it too long and boring because viewers can get actually tired so i believe you've been able to understand um how this youtube video works so if you want to learn how to create a youtube channel i'll be putting the link on my description so that you can actually create your youtube channel and then get started with working so you need to find a niche you can actually um, be on and then create content that your viewers your audience your targeted audience would always want to watch because by the time they search for keywords on their on their youtube search and then they see different videos with different thumbnails with different titles they get attracted to one or one or the other so for you to get to the top you need to be consistent you need to put in the right keywords search terms and the rest so i'll be explaining that in an upcoming videos on how to go about optimizing your youtube video so see you in the next video thank you